Ông Jones muốn có gì trong phòng ngủ? Ông Jones muốn có gì trong phòng ngủ? Phòng ăn ở đâu? Phòng ăn ở đâu? Phòng Còn. đó Phòng cũng cách. Có Còn gì cách nữa? Phòng đó Cũng có gì nữa? Now turn to the dialogue section. Now turn to the dialogue the section. Will the, the instructor in will Now read the entire dialogue in Vietnamese. Hello. And Đây I'll accompany her Vietnam. with the English translation. This is the Vien Dong Hotel. Hello. This is the Vien Dong Hotel. I would like to reserve a double room. I would like to reserve a double room. What kind of room? What kind of room, sir? Yeah. Có máy lạnh và điện thoại. A room with air conditioning and a telephone. A room with air conditioning and a telephone. Okay. How long, How long would you like to rent? Từ hôm nay tới thứ bảy này. From today to this Saturday. From today to this Saturday. Mỗi ngày. The rent is two thousand piastres a day. The rent is two thousand a day. được. Tôi tới liền. Chào ông. Okay. I'll be there right now. I'll be there right now. Goodbye. Cảm ơn ông. Chào ông. 1885. The grasslands of Wyoming. Now she reads each sentence slowly. Saskiar Samai by Kandemir Ulu.
the hero approaches the home of his beloved. This is 2M Talk, Ripple Testing. Hello, CQ. Hello. Hello, Ash. Hello, Ash. Ash, hello. Are the signals okay? Wave your hand if it's all okay. Hello, CQ. Hello, CQ. This is 2M Talk, Ripple Testing. This is 2M Talk, Ripple Testing. North London are outlawing a bizarre new protest by a Highgate artist against plans to widen the Archway Road into a freeway for lorries. With a fifth public inquiry into the controversial scheme adjourned, protesters have transformed a house, it's one of those facing demolition, into a sort of anti-juggernaut sculpture. But the police have threatened obscenity charges after passers-by complained about the sculptor hanging dummies from the roof. From Highgate, Mark Percy reports. 186 Archway Road is no ordinary two up, two down. Chunks of chopped up car tyres sprout from the walls of the terraced house, which is also emblazoned with vast blue and red oblong shapes. Even more bizarre, a row of four gibbets leaning out from the roof. And that's where the controversial dummies were hung by nooses around their neck until the local police got them taken down on the grounds that they're obscene. Well, the man who created this weird display is Sculptor Flippo, as he calls himself. Now, as we speak, you're standing holding a dummy uh, with a noose around its neck. Well, what happened when you tried to put this up on the gibbets? Well, I had two, two of them up, and uh, I was then visited by the police to say that they'd had a complaint and that I would have to take them down. I asked on what grounds, and I was told that uh, that if they weren't removed, I would be likely to be charged with uh, obscenity. Meanwhile, Flippo, who refuses to reveal his real name and says he's aged somewhere around 30, explains how many more Londoners could soon be made aware of his unique talents as a sculptor. What I'd really like to do would be to cover London in, a, in, a, in an enormous web of sculpture. She was here. Well, ambitious project there. That was Mark Percy reporting from Highgate. Here's Friends, Douglas reporting from the studio. Yes, good evening. Extraneous conversation. So secure, I am Hugh. You. So I like you in, in English. Hugh. Hugo in, in Italian. Hugo in Italiano. I am English so no and I live in England. In I am from London. So no I am a Londoner. Parlo I speak e English and Italian. Now, Ernest arriva arrives, Ernesto, and then arriva Carla arrives. Ernesto è un Ernest amico italiano. is an Italian friend, e Carla and una Carla amica is an Italian friend. Where is Ernest? Dove è Ernesto? This is the hymn, the Olympic hymn, and there is Richard Strauss is conducting it. Here comes the runner. He's got his torch. He's a fair young man uh, in white shorts, running in. Beautifully made, a very fine uh, sight as an athlete. He's running by all the officials. People are waving their hats at him. He's holding it high in his right hand. It seems to be 
I mean, there's some, uh, I don't quite know what, what the torch is made of, but he's holding it high, taking long race, raking strides. Now he's gone down the track. He's come away over to the left and he's running up to this brazier, which, which uh, he'll light the Olympic fire, which will keep going for the whole of the, as long as the games are on. He's running up the steps now with his torch. There he goes. Young man, at the top of the steps now, and at the top of these steps is a large thing on three legs, a big red razor, much taller than the man. Is it? Oh, Joe, it's wonderful. He lit it, and the whole thing now is blazing flame. Oh, a wonderful sight, wonderful. I went forward and unbolted the inner door. They slowly swung open. And there, filling the entire area within, stood an immense yellow quartzite sarcophagus. In a dead silence, the huge... When the house is demolished over a to build a new sausage factory, workmen uncover some extraordinary objects. This was but the lid of a series of three coffins nested one within the other, enclosing the mortal remains of the young King Tutank Amor. In order not to delay the building of the sausage factory beyond the statutory maximum, the dig must begin immediately. The historic artifacts are unearthed and recorded by scientific photographers, as are all aspects of the deconstruction process. The beloved succumbs to the groundsman's demands. Discover 
significant links with elements found in an ancient metropolis hundreds of miles away. The archaeologists discover significant links with elements found in an ancient metropolis hundreds of miles Discovered away. Back in about 1977, some black and white outtakes from an undergraduate film had been left in the cutting room, where subsequently they'd been used picture junk in a, in a color film about 1970s protest movement. But of all the films listed in the British National uh, Film and Video Catalog on this and related subjects produced about that time, we could find no trace of the second film. Now, assuming that the, the color film was therefore never released the or never completed, being, it followed on with the introduction of footage from the long with the question of and other material. With, must have followed the same process as before. That is to say, that finite, second film, despite it already incorporated picture Now what is this table, question, if not that Paleo-Writer's history by materialism? Not that Stoicism is a materialism. On the contrary, it is a repression of the materialism of Epicurus and Democritus. A successful repression indeed. And the more interesting in that it offers, in the sign, the very mechanism mounted in the discussion with the materialist thinkers of antiquity. In order to occult the infinity of matter and substitute in its place the property of finitude of electron, projection of the syllogism. in a dictionary do not make one sentence. All the words cannot Let's take be simultaneously Russia. considered. Your trip will be much more enjoyable when you can meet people and make yourself understood. Listen to this recording and repeat what you hear. Listen, then repeat. Are you ready to travel? Yes. Done. No. Нет. Please. Thank you. Спасибо. Thank you very much. Большое спасибо. That's all right. Не за что. Could you speak more slowly, please? Могли бы вы говорить медленнее? Please point to the phrase in the book. Покажите мне, пожалуйста, фразу в книге. Just a minute. I'll see if I can find it in this book. Минуточку. Я посмотрю, смогу ли я ее найти в книжке. This camera doesn't work. Этот аппарат не работает. A great tragedy had befallen the city. I understand. And much of its treasure remained buried for many years. This camera doesn't work. Этот аппарат не работает. I understand. Я понимаю. I don't understand. Я не понимаю. Is there any mail for me? Есть для меня почта? Are there any messages for me? Did anyone telephone me? Мне кто-нибудь звонил? There's a call for you. 
вас к телефону. Hold the line, please. Подождите у телефона. Do you speak Spanish? Do you speak Italian? Social potential has become the private power of the few. Private property has made us so stupid and one-sided that an object is only ours when we have it, when it exists for us as capital, or when it is directly possessed, eaten, drunk, worn, inhabited, when it is used by us. The essence is not in the object, it is the meaning of the object, the principle of the series of appearances which disclose it. Some relics are damaged beyond repair. Capable of being apprehended among others, no meaning of the object. The object does not refer to being as a signification. It would be impossible, for example, to define being as present since absence to disclose being. Since not to be there means still to be. taking into account shots, color shots, what seemed to be friends of the camera operator, and more color shots of the dartboard. Both of these come in positive and negative. And it didn't explain the scratch the color of some of the original black and white material. Above all, we could not account for the apparent conventionality of the order of the sequences of the different materials towards the end of compilation. Namely, character from the original black and white film waving goodbye intercut with the commercial color footage of the groundsman apparently riding his lawnmower off into the sunset. Project replaces the fundamental philosophical question, that of being, with a question of signifying. The groundsman and his friends celebrate. Outside, the people march on the royal palace. The heroic groundsman cannot understand the archaeological reconstructions. 
and finds it impossible to concentrate on his tennis. Being a person, 
Returning home, he is comforted by his beloved. All consciousness is positional in that it transcends itself in order to reach an object and it exhausts itself in this same positioning. I don't know, I did a sausage factory man, and, and he took us through his sausage factory, and it was great. Why did you enjoy the sausage factory so much? Well, it was just so great. God, have you ever been, been in one? Uh, yes, about 25 years ago. Really? Where, where, where was it? Um, it was near Calm in Wiltshire. Oh, really? Oh, well, gee. Right in the middle of the English countryside. Oh, this this was a German one, and it was so big. It was like a couple block block long, and and uh, they just made everything, everything I really liked. What you liked looking at the food, did you? And eating it, yeah. They give us free samples. Well, the free sample came almost as part of the fee, did it? Ah, uh, yes. Mm -hmm. Would you like it if people actually gave you things for making profits instead of paying you money? Yeah, you mean like like a year supply of sausage? Gradually, yeah, the archaeologists uncover important uh, similarities. Oh, sometimes. So, in, in this proposed total restructuring of society, given that it's agreed upon that this is a, a useful and uh, important thing to take place, success at last. You know, education, is it a question of uh, protest? It's like firstly, a question of uh, education. Because the question of protest is too... Uh, by only, this, only, the people, yeah, only the people with protest, uh, with the ability to protest, they protest only when they know the problem and they find reasons to protest. Therefore, already the protest is an act of solidarity as a result of education and information. Yes, information. Information, education, participation. These are the three very important things in the culture. Yes, but now the, the, the culture is exactly so organized. There is no possibility to become educated for everybody. Yes, only privileged persons can enter the schools. 
then uh, it's not uh, ability for the majority to participate in all uh, cultural events and other events in the society. Yes. And there is no information, because the information we know from the TV is manipulation, it's lie. Yes, from the beginning to the end is a lie or a distortion of the, distortion of the problems. Therefore, the most important things, participation, education, and information. The revolt is defeated, not and the royal digger returns to the palace. This is the problem where we try to start this. All other things would be illusions. Now I'm coming back to brain then, taking in special data, <laughs> recording and so forth, but mine very apparently spurred on by intuition that something's going on here that's, that's worth, worth pursuing, that's really inspiring human beings to spend their whole lives at, at such work as Kepler did. There, it suddenly discovered a relationship existing between. There was nothing in the geometry, geometrical dimensions of our Earth or geometrical dimensions of the Moon. There was nothing in the chemistry of either the, or anything in the electromagnetics of them that said, observing one by itself, that's going to attract another body. Absolutely nothing. Certainly, there was nothing in any one of those bodies that said, if you have the distance, the inner attraction is going to increase at fourfold or second power exponentially. What I'm really trying to get out, I don't think anything more important for me to catch on to, or you to catch on to, we really want to understand a little about what, what human beings do have that is unique in the universe, which is this mind, is this ability to discover relationships existing between that are not ours, any of the special cases out there. Otherwise, when you get to the beginnings of great science, what the experimental undertaking, you discover a priori absolute mystery within which a priori absolute mystery, a, a, a lucidly behaving regularity occurs, an incredible, lo lovely thing. These, these are, of, of, we have the word synergy, or the behavior of whole systems unpredicted by the behavior of any of the parts considered only separately. So we find all the great scientific discoveries are exactly that. They are discovering the, be the behavior between that is not of in any way indicated is going to happen by any of the parts themselves. So all the great scientific discoveries are synergetic. I, I could see quite clearly the word was not popular, and in as much as the word is the only word that means behavior of whole systems unpredicted by behavior of the parts, synergy is the only word that means that, quite clearly society was not thinking there are such behaviors, or they would have had, really wanted the word. In fact, it did when it was not a popular word. It was not in, in the general, general well, we rationalizing and logic. Um, I saw human beings then were quite content to just know about parts. They were content to be uh, taken to school and, and say, now, darling, I'm going to give you an A and B and C, and and just to work on parts, putting things together. Uh, that, the idea, if they build up a body of knowledge, would be the whole sum total of that's all there was to it. And this is just right, quite contrary then to the Keep turning to me, it's very, very exciting. I find myself really pulling a so curtain apart a flash of to understand a little of what really has gone on uh, historically yes, of, of the gradual the trial and error gains of the naked, helpless, ignorant man finally yeah. discovering such a phenomenon yeah. that he has he's got endowed also with the intuition that somehow rather titivates him that something's going on around here and I better pursue it. Don't you think people would get bored with that? Well, uh, well, I mean, they get bored with a good show, so. And this wouldn't be a good show. No, it'd just be a, an inform. Like it would just show what's a. what's uh, on the street corner. Royal. Just showing uh, 24 hours on on the street corner. I think people Feast. people look at anything. So that you'd be able to turn on and you'd see the same street corner all day long, day and uh, night. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's like looking out of the window. Happy end. A 
royal feast and a happy end.